comes the axe. Prove yourself. Yeah, I'm actually gonna just go for that first other blast on top of Decrep. Second God, round of it. Get out of my lane. He actually might just kill him here. Decrep comes out yet again. FNG's in the area for the body blocks, and Nine <laughs> has to throw out the stun, slowed up yet again. Finds first blood. Nine. Easy peasy. The skeleton man. 3.5 seconds to the top lane. They will get the finish off, though, as the three throws. Yeah, I'm actually going to just go for that first other blast on top of Decrep. Second God, round of it. Get out of my lane. He actually might just kill him here. Decrep comes out yet again. FNG's in the area for the body blocks, and Nine <laughs> has to throw out the stun, slowed up yet again. Finds first blood. Nine. Easy peasy. The skeleton man. 3.5 seconds to the top lane. They will get the finish off, though, as the three throw low ground. Doesn't get the best vision. Decrep out already at the get go. They knew that they were up there on the high ground, and now finding Biver. They're going for the long duration life drain. Nine. Able to get it, the blast afterwards. They do still have that hood on the axe, keeping them a little bit more tanky, but eventually the toss, the chase, the kill, it comes out. Skitter trying to run away as they chase him down with the Weaver and that Dragonite. Very low on the armor, he falls. And a second kill here, possibly. Silencer ends up dying. Quick and easy. Uh, in this game, it's going to happen about four or five minutes earlier. So at that point, like, first, you definitely aren't that far behind. As FNG will TP out. No, the stun is there from F Ninja. Scan because they uh, are taking down that top tower with zero defense. TP's coming in though. Has to Joe jump, call, turn it back around. The disarm is there, so he's not punching him. And the chase board, F Ninja able to find himself there. the one. He has buyback. Gooch as well. Nine chase, curse crown on top of him. They get the damage out, and FNG gonna start throwing out some tracks. Find themselves. Out, he would have been ready. Now he's oh, gonna die. Oh, bad score. No, no, I just <laughs> shouted you out. No, well, that hurts with the changes, too. Oh, the flat 25. Oh, oh that guy's dead for 51 seconds. <laughs> oh, oh, no, and over here to the side. Axe gets Avatos. The full combo comes through. They're gonna take down one trying to run. Can they get out of there? The fear for these wards as they spot them just sitting next to the shrine. Have a toss, find themselves one, try to get to the shrine, not going to be there in time, the global. And mid lane, you cannot afford to lose yourself one like that. The jump in, the call, it connects onto both of them as they went for the relocate, but immediately chasing forward. Team Spirit willing to dive the tier 3 tower, actually, and chase down Afterlife. They do get the relocate away at the last second. Oh, man. I'm going to go back up top. Terrorize. Oh, that terrorize. It connects. That's pretty big That's for him. That's a big kill. He's the richest person in this game. No. F Ninja will get his revenge. Go with the blast. Quick jump. Everybody's there. Hello, hello. How are you doing, Mr. Pugna? Global to follow it. Wow. Everything in the game. Or this gyrocopter. There are some things that go through it, though. Obviously, Global, which, speaking of which, Hester Joe just kills off the silence. Ellie Sash game. Like. How? How is that even possible? Oh, he didn't have global silence and obviously being dead still helps with that. Nice terrorize, trying to find a kill. Can they do it in time? It will, no FNG more. gets the track. Never leave. <laughs> oh no, poor fan score. He's got 39 gold and a dream that that's taken away from him. 3,000 gold towards team spirit. He might know, okay. Oh, no. he doesn't get the last hit. Oh, this is epic. Bounty Hunter's chasing someone mid, but I want to see if this curse. Oh, nah, I can't get the left. This is looking like it could potentially be a dead Dragonite. I'm gonna pop the BKB, run forward, see if you can take this fight. But with the BKB wearing off in a second and Tiny nearby, they could be going for the Avatos combo, looking for the opening. Instead, they go up to the high ground, find the Willow, and Axe says, I do not. Look how fast that I was with gyros. The drums are even popped. Bottom lane, advanced score, just food once more. Call comes. Time lapse was there. Hesta Joe, has he gone too far? Yes, indeed, he duty. Nice bait. Even Sav. Ridiculous. All right, stun comes out, though. And now a two person call. They're going back into this fight. Are they going to be able to stay around and turn this back around? They kill off the axe. BKB out from Apple Ninja. With the gem on the ground, the tracks starting to be mounted, and the Aegis already having been burned through. Team Spirit. Make it work. 
Weaver also in trouble here. Thanks to my able to get the kill onto Hesta Joe, but the D helicopter trying to keep this buddy alive. Satanic, hello, how are you doing, buddy? Chase down this axe. I heard you wanted to party. I'm gonna beat your ass with a missile. They chase forward for more. They are gonna be able to find the kill on FNG. So no more tracks after the fact. Now the curse crowd chasing forward for him, but the IO still keeping their buddy alive. The bedlam. Can they bring these two down? The dynamic duo are eventually going to fall. And Snap. my god, Furzy, they're doing it. A bunch of heroes the music pack. They're doing it. The Fat Rack music pack. They need to get to the shrine. It is going to be there in time, but the call, it still comes out. They get the lift up there. Fuel Scepter, nine, done. Kill oh, off yet down. another. The buyback, Io Gyro. BKB's now, like, versus the Pugna. Nine's having a hard time really impacting the fight despite his massive net worth. Up on the high ground, there's the stun. Uh, Hesta Joe finds themselves a juicy target, but don't forward. They're able to find it. The blade mail with the axe call, but it's not enough yet again. That satanic out. They buy back on the silencer. The global is going to connect. They try a lot of levels and stuff, but do you think that. Wait, we gotta hold that thought. There might be yeah, a terror. We need axe for this fight, though. This is so tough without him. Fear? Like, kind of, awesome. don't mention them to your team. Oh, yeah. I, uh, you don't want 25, right? <laughs> oh, Van score. No, oh, he misses. No, he's looking at them. <laughs> I was looking over there. Uh, but... uh, Finds himself the Dark Willow. A good stun is there, though. The status resistance, making sure it doesn't do all that much. The call hits nothing. And they are going to hit nothing. Skinner trying to do this. The IO jumps in, able to heal now with the tether and the mech. But has to Joe Rotten. Actually, the one that's going to get taken down. Weaver looking for those squishy supports. He was able to find that tiny and well fuel scepter lift up on the axe no more call for you he is dead terrorize on top of everything okay that's a lot and can they kill him off in time they do dunk one they're going to dunk two they don't have buyback on the gyro his buyback he okay there are creeps that are pushing into the base but Still Furzy chasing here. They find themselves yet another. This is nine caught Aeon Disc there, but they're gonna be able to find the call after the fact. He's dead too. If Furzy decide to stick around, and indeed they will, they find themselves the bounty hunter. The old scepter lift up, don't quite get the kill, but meanwhile, has Joe able to take down King All. Slowing them down for the moment. BKB afterwards, has to Joe there. The big call now onto the gyrocopter. Briefly, and all of the regen in the world coming from the Pugna and the Io. Can they kill him off in time? Yes! They take down Gyrocopter, and now the Weaver chasing for it for more. Good Yule Scepter from FNG, able to interrupt them for the moment. Time lapse, still chasing away. They buy back on the Tiny. The two-man call, though, catches on to both of them. Able to find that kill on a Pugna. Yes, indeed. Double kill. I mean, he should borrow one from FNG. He's got seven. I mean, maybe he could ask nicely, and he'd hand one over or something to the other team. Fan score. Story of his life. Has buyback. Behind, but he has buyback like a good silencer player. Ooh. That could have been a big call, but didn't quite have the blink off cooldown. There's the mute, there's the catch, Skitter. He's got the Lotus Orb, keeping him alive. Now the jump, it's gonna come out, but they're breaking the blink dagger of the axe. They can't get it. Dark will go into the Shadow Realm. They've got him under fire, terrorize out as well. Kited to all get out. An axe eventually going to fall. Axic turns, wanting to take down one. They're focusing too many different targets. That's not working, but the Weaver! He blows through.